Hey yo, this is God of Stocks coming to you with another banger. Like I do say, money doesn't sleep, so that's why you gotta stay awake so money doesn't sleep on you. Before I get into this video, I just wanna let you know that I'm not a financial advisor. And before you make any investments, I would like you to do your due diligence first and you should consult with your financial advisor before you do any investments. In this video, I'll be talking about Marine Software and I'll give you guys the latest updates on Marine Software. And also, there will be a $1,000 cash giveaway. And rules for the giveaway include like this video, subscribe to the channel, comment and share the video. So back to Marin Software. So today Marin was down 16% and it closed at around $14.45. And during after hours, it was down about 1%, closing at around $14.25. And also one thing you guys should understand is that there is dark pool trading going down for Marin Software. And if you guys don't know what dark pool trading means or if you don't know what dark pool is, so a dark pool is a private security exchange in which investors typically large financial institutions are able to make trades anonymously so they can be able to make trades through the dark pool and one thing you guys should understand is that whenever they buy a stock through dark pool the price doesn't reflect immediately on the market so the only time the price shows on the market is when it gets reported so they can have their buying pressure in the dark pool and when they are about to sell they sell on the public market which creates you know a selling pressure and apart from that something else you guys should know is that your brokers do sell data do sell your own data to hedge funds so these hedge funds they do know where your stop losses are so that's why sometimes whenever they are dragging the price of a stock down they try to drag it way down to your stop loss and whenever it hits your stop loss it even drives the price of the stock even lower so that's one thing you should keep in mind but i wouldn't tell you guys to remove your stop loss because you guys do have it as a form of risk management but that's something you guys should keep in mind because these hedge funds they do see your stop losses and also today we are waiting for the short interest data from nasdaq and finally nasdaq later released the short interest data for marine software and as you can see the percentage of flow short that for marine software is about 47 percent but everyone was expecting the percentage of flow short to be above 100 percent because if this was above 100 percent this could have been a big catalyst for marine software but right now the percentage of flow short that is about 47 percent so right now marine is the fourth most shortest stock according to market watch but the data from Altes shows different because according to Altes, over 100 percent of marine stock is being short then so if we can go to the chart the hourly time frame for the chart we can see that we initially had a support around that 16 dollar range but we later broke the support going as low as 1380 and right now the new support is around that 14 dollar range and also if we can get more volume for marine tomorrow this is gonna send the price of the stock up so i'm hoping we get more volume tomorrow which is gonna push the price of the stock up and also one thing i would like you guys to do is to put your limit sell to be above hundred dollars and make sure you like this video comment down below and share it so it can go viral peace Mm-hmm. <laughs>